What is up guys, Nelly here and welcome to Mask of the Day episode 71. As I said in the comments of my uh, last Mask of the Day that I was going to take a break yesterday, the new Call of Duty game came out and I intend to be uploading Call of Duty every single day alongside a Payday 2 video every single day. So any of you worrying that the Payday 2 content is going to go down? Absolutely not. If you guys are fans of Payday 2 then the fact that I'm now going to be doing Call of Duty and don't particularly like Call of Duty that is it's not going to affect you at all. Uh, if you're a huge fan of Call of Duty, but not a huge one of Payday 2, uh, then again, that's not going to affect you at all. One Call of Duty video a day, one Payday 2 video a day, and if you're a fan of both, then all the more videos coming from me. So there we go. Uh, we're going back to our superhero theme for maybe two more episodes. Uh, this one and then Batman, unless there's a fantastic idea from anybody. Obviously, this was in celebration of Arkham Origins, which is a brilliant game. Uh, just, just a couple of quick views on Call of Duty Ghosts. Is I really enjoy the game. It's got a few issues on the PC version, but I'm going to do a Call of Duty video at a later date, uh, really explaining what I think about the video, about the video, about the game. So here we have the Hulk. Uh, and we're going to be doing it on the most obvious mask. It's a Halloween mask. It is Frank. So let's get to customizing this. I intend to move away from these sort of masks. I know a lot of you guys are on Xbox and cannot obtain it, so this may be one of the last ones for a while. So let's go for the Material Radioactive, the Hulk of course, being that sort of darkish green tone. For the pattern, now, the pattern's a pain, because basically with the pattern you want to get his black hair, and there is not a single pattern that can do that. The uh, Aurora Boris, whether that's what it's supposed to be named, I'm still not sure, uh, works quite well. However, I found that the best thing to use is in fact lift off. At least that has a slight semblance of what you're after. So finally, for the color you want black, of course for the black hair, and leaf green to keep around about the same tone as the face. And there we have it. It's a pity we can't get at least hair along the top here, but this will have to do. The black eyes kind of work for me. The Hulk's eyes tend to be a sort of darkish green. So that is about it. He looks sort of sad but angry <laughs> you know confused and pissed off at the same time is always a uh, scary thing so that's the sort of facial expression he's got going on and that is my Hulk mask so like I say Batman coming up tomorrow unless you guys have any other great superhero ideas that's a lot for watching guys obviously Hulk is not from the same universe but hey I uh, I thought this mask might be quite a popular one for those of you who enjoy your superheroes